Hey guys, it's Nicole and welcome to this video. In this video, I have a little Christmas makeup tutorial for you. I know I haven't done a makeup tutorial in so long on my channel. I love makeup so much. I'm not that good at it, but I'm getting there. So I know you're probably all curious on how I achieved this look. So let's go ahead and get into this video. Finally, the Christmas headband makes sense. So I'm so happy to do this tutorial. Now we're gonna prime our eyelids using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and my beauty blender to blend it out. Then we're going to set that using my Rimmel Translucent Powder and an e.l.f. powder brush. Then we're going to take an e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and grab this maroon shade from the 35O palette by Morphe and use that as our transition shade. Then next we're going to grab the same type of brush and we're going to grab a reddish brown and blend that into almost the same spot, just not as high. Then we're going to take a more tapered brush and take a brown color into our outer corner to add some definition. Then using my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and a lip brush, we're going to go ahead and cut our crease. And then I like to use my Beauty Blender to blend it out so that way it has a more even looking blend. Then using an eyeshadow brush, just a regular one, flat, you know, we're going to use a white shade to set that concealer. That was such an awkward way to say that, but oh well, here we go. Then we're going to use a clean Morphe 441 brush and blend all that eyeshadow together. Then we're going to take the truest red from the Morphe palette and blend that between the darkest brown and the white shade. And then we're just going to prime our face and I'm not using foundation, I'm just going to use concealer. I'm not really a foundation kind of person. If you guys watch my channel and any of my other videos, you would know that. Then I'm going to go ahead and take another concealer, the Fit Me one, and put that under my eyes as well because I don't sleep very often, so I can use all help. Then we're going to use the Rimmel Translucent Powder to set all of that concealer down. Then going in with a light brown shade, we're going to blend that underneath our eye, and then using that maroon shade that we use as our transition color, we're going to put that just in the outer corner for definition. Then, I'm so boring with my brows, so I'm not even going to explain it, I just use this $3 e.l.f. kit and I only use the wax part and I brush on my brows, it's really boring, whatever. Then we're going to use this Wet n Wild Contour Kit and this Contour Brush by e.l.f. and just contour, you know, the, the normal contour places. And then the places that we contoured, I'm going to put the NYC bronzer on top of, I love this bronzer, like I cannot find any bronzer that I like more than this. Then we're going to take this Wet n Wild Ombre Blush and put that on our face because it's so beautiful. Then we're going to take this beautiful highlight by Colourpop. It's called Flexitarian. It's definitely too light for me, but I don't care. I love it. It's so glowy. And then we're going to take our e.l.f. baked highlighter and put that right over. A lot of people hate this highlighter, but you honestly just have to scratch off the top layer and then it works perfectly fine. And then for our inner corner, we're going to take a super small e.l.f. brush and we're going to add this beautiful green color from the 35B palette. I love this, that's me telling my sister how much I like it. And then I'm gonna take this, you know, black eyeliner, tight line, and yeah, we're just going. And then we're gonna take this charcoal color and we're just gonna buff that out into our eye, just as, cause I don't really have eyelashes and I'm not gonna wear fake eyelashes. So I just want to make my lash line look nice and black. Then we're gonna curl our lashes, cause like I said, we don't have any. We're gonna take the L'Oreal, telescopic mascara to really get the length. I love the length that this mascara gives my lashes. And then for all the black and volume, we're good using my Maybelline Lash Sensational. This is so good. This combo is so good. Then on the lips, we're taking the Maybelline Matte Lipstick in Darling Nude and we're putting on top of it this beautiful Dandelion Lip Gloss by Benefit. I love this lip gloss and we're just going to blend that in with our finger. And then to set everything, we're taking our Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. I just got this and oh my god, I love it. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what your favorite part is about this makeup look. My favorite part is probably the green inner corner highlight, just because that's, I feel like, the main thing of this look. I did that. That's like a meme if you didn't know. I hope you guys liked it. I'll see you in my next video. Bye and Merry Christmas or Happy Holidays because I don't really know what you celebrate. Bye. <laughs> I have a band aid so I can't really snap, but I tried. I really did. <laughs>